Hey guys, Busmaster99 here, and today I'm going to be taking an in-depth walk around of the 2017 Ford F-150 XLT. Here's what the key looks like. Push-button ignition is available. Front two windows are fully automatic. And the, the rear are manual, but they're all powered nonetheless. When it comes to the transmission, it is a six speed power shift. And it also has low gear selections. as well as tow haul or sport modes. No backup camera. This does have four wheel drive. And if you wanna switch between high and low range, make sure the transmission is in neutral, then turn the knob. So now I'm going to flip on the exterior lighting. Let's go see how that looks on the outside. You can also opt for LED headlights. Hmm, that's weird. Only one fog light works and this is a brand new truck. It's got a capless fuel system and it's also a flex fuel vehicle. Let's go ahead and pop the hood. So under the hood, let's see, I believe this is the 3.5 naturally aspirated V6. I don't see any EcoBoost labels or anything, so I'm pretty sure this is the standard engine. Here's the coolant tank. There's the battery. There's the windshield wiper fluid. I'm not exactly sure of the horsepower of this engine, but I assume it's like 305 or something like that. So that's pretty cool. All right. Shutting the hood and I'm gonna go back inside and take a look at some more features. Manual climate control, fan speed, temperature control. You also do have max AC. And then likewise you have max defrost power button so that turns the climate on and off three different zones or no two different zones oh wait it is three it's just hidden defrost recycle AC to heat switch that turns traction control off Wiper controls are on the turn signal stock. Instrument panel brightness is controlled through here.
cargo light. And your parking brake is right down here. So to use it, as it says, you pull the switch to engage and push it into release with your foot on the brake. Window locks. Vehicle lock and unlock is down here. Cruise control. You can see all your different menus right from here using the buttons on the left side of the steering wheel. Turn your daytime running lights on and off. That's pretty much all there is to show. Stay tuned for more, as always. And peace out.